Welcome back to my channel. On this episode, I'm going to look at how I turn my Evolve GTR Carbon into my own personal custom painted hydro tip ripping machine. Let's have a look. Also, please stay tuned to the end of the video where I'll be announcing the winner of naming my new board and the winner of the new 7 inch 18 knobbly tyres in blue. Let's check it out. Okay, so what processes were involved to turn my Evolve GTR Carbon into the design it is in now? So, First stage, what you need to do is firstly strip the board apart to all its raw materials. That's taking out all the electronics, taking off the wheels, the hubs, and leaving yourself with a just a barren deck. So just a deck only, lid and enclosure. I've also had the wheels done, so I've had to take the wheels, the inner tubes, and tires off. So I've just got the hubs only for painting. The next stage is to take it to the paint shop. Now, the guys who done this build for me, help me with my paint job, were Kent Custom Dips in Kent. I'm going to leave the link in the description down below, but thank you very much guys, you've done an amazing job with the board, so let's go with how they did it. And what they do is, first of all, they take the board and they primer it in one solid colour, so it's grey all over the whole enclosure, so it's a nice clear coat ready for painting. The next stage is what you need to decide is what colour you want it to be. Now this needs to be a really harsh colour, so if you want it a blue or a red or an orange, whatever colour you decide has to be a really strong colour. I decided for it to be white. So as you can see, it's a really, really bright white as a base layer, so it has to be painted that colour really strong. The next thing you need to do is look at the design of what any text, any font or any logos or branding you want to be done. So that is a decal that gets made and then gets stuck underneath or where the, your design is going to be placed. So on my board I've got my YouTube channel, I've got Carve Electric UK logo and obviously the words Carve Electric underneath the board. So once that's done then they do some a next level which is that personal touch. What they do is they do hand air brushing. So what they do is they've added some camo details underneath the board. So there's different dimensions of the paint. So it's not just white with snakes going over the top. You've got darks, you've got the blacks, you've got the greys, you've got those different colours to really make it pop. Next stage is hydro dipping. Now this process takes about four weeks, the whole process in total. So when you're hydro dipping, you decide, you decide the um, film you're going to have placed. So I decided to have white snake sink, give that kind of natural, kind of edgy look is what I'm looking for. So the film goes over the water, and then you dip the board in so it's nice and clear, and then instantaneously you get the design to come over. You need to allow this to dry. And once that is dried, you're going to turn the board on the opposite end, put the lid back on, and then we're going to seal the other side. So both sides are done with the hydro dipping design. That needs to be allowed to dry. The next stage is to seal it, so it's one clear colour over the whole thing. So it's nice and clear coat, so it's locked in, so there's not going to be chips, any, any, any scratches on underneath the board. The hubs are done as well, so they're the same process, but they obviously don't have the snakeskin design on them as well. The next stage is process, I took it back to Evolve HQ in the UK. Then I asked the guys over there, Matt, Milan, the engineers over there, who helped me reassemble this board. So, went to reassembly, really nice easy job, got ourselves some new tyres, got it reassembled, all put back together. So very, I want to say thank you very much for Milan and Matt Global for appreciating the help you guys gave me putting the board back together. So thank you very much. One thing that's special about this board is that it's actually an Easter egg in the board that no one knows unless I've told you personally. I'm going to show you now. Jeff from Evolve was over for the Maidenhead carting event. So what I was able to do, I was, getting, I was able to get him to sign the enclosure inside the lid. So I've got a personal message from Jeff. So it's very much appreciated. So it's got that personal touch just for me. No one else can see it, but it's just for me. So thank you very much, Jeff, if you're watching. And I really appreciate you putting that little personal flair on my board. Okay, right, so look at the competition winner. The winner of the Evolve 7 inch knobbly tyres is going to be Kevin Yee with the name Viper. So, introducing the Evolve GTR Viper. So, well done, Kevin. I want to say thank you to everyone else who put a comment below on the name. It's very much appreciated. But, Kevin Yee, you're going to give yourself a week to be in contact with me. So, either on my Instagram at Thomas B Boy Stretch or contact me on Facebook and I'll about shipping where you want me to ship this over to. So congratulations Kevin and thank you for everyone else for submitting. So if you've enjoyed this video and you've hopefully got any questions, anything I can help with about you doing your own build, please leave a comment in below and if I can help you out at all, let me know. The link for the place I've got it done for Kent Custom Dits will be down below and any other questions, let me know. So thank you very much for watching. More content coming out soon. There's some crazy stuff coming soon, okay guys? So I hope you appreciate it. Hope you have a good time and enjoy. Bye.